Welcome back to an all new Mari after the results. Today, we're finding out what happens after the DNA results are revealed and if these denying dads actually stepped up. So we'll never forget a furious young mother named Ashley who came here to prove to a man named Rome that he was the father of her daughter, Loyalty. Now, Rome's denial stemmed from one physical trait. It was, of course, the baby's skin tone. It's all because, Ashley, of the way your daughter looks. Yes, because she has blonde hair and blue eyes and light skin. I shouldn't even have to do something like this. I shouldn't have to prove that this is his child. You think they look alike? Of course, like they have the same facial features, like the mouth, the nose. You see that baby got blonde hair and blue eyes right now? That's your baby. You she see that like baby got blonde hair? Look at that bitch. And you're not together? Hey, look, hey, look, we be together sometime. <laughs> Does anybody in your family or Rome's family favor blonde hair, blue eyes, light skin? Well, of course, you have light skinned people all throughout the family, but we were told his great uncle has blonde hair, blue eyes. Yeah, and black people come in all shades, of course. We're all shades, colors, we're black. We're black people. Everything was fine until the child was born. When the baby come out, I'm looking. I say, baby, baby, baby got blonde hair. I look at her. Don't give a damn if she has green hair. Yeah. It's your baby. This is the doctor, baby. <laughs> In the case of two month old loyalty, Rome, you are the father. Exactly. Oh. Boo. Yeah. After that show, Ashley and Rome not only stayed together, guess what, everybody? They welcomed another child. So we wish them all the best. Next up is Crystal. Crystal was positive a man named John was the father of her son, Kyle. Now, as you're about to see, this DNA battle escalated into a full-on family feud. John wasn't around during the pregnancy. I was forced to him. I, would, I had to call him and be like, hey, I have a doctor's appointment. Hey, Kyle's born. You have seven yeah. kids. The yeah, ones he claimed. Kids. And yeah, also, I'm in all, I'm in all their the lives. ones he claimed. You have been duped before when it came to having children, right? I'm Plenty pretty sure time. you won't stop Plenty popping them out. Plenty, Plenty of times time. you were told that you were the father and you weren't the father. Looked out for him, we did what you know what you're supposed to do as a family. That's and, not uh, my problem. When them That's test results problem. came back, it was 0.0%. You're 6'9. Giant. Yeah, I'm somewhere up there. Somewhere, yeah. yeah. A giant, wow. giant. Kyle is two years old. A normal two year old is like 33 inches. And Kyle right, right. is 43 inches. I right. mean, Kyle was born. You told my right. people with his hair, it looks like he's like Macaulay Culkin. Uh, yeah, and now I'm looking at you, Marie. It <laughs> might look like, like yours. Really? <laughs> now that I'm thinking about that. It was time to hear from Carla and Chardonnay and reveal the paternity test results. Watch. How do you feel about this DNA issue that involves your son? That's my grandson. When I had John Marvin, when he was a baby, I thought they brought me the wrong baby. Oh, is that right? He don't have to have nothing that looked like you to be yours. Yeah, he do. He you looked like his mother. Do, John says you should have his back. You're his mom. You I do have yeah, his back. And being a mother is teaching my child okay, so to how many right times, back. How many times we done went through this, though, Mom? Why are you going against her? It's not about going against right. her. It's exactly. It's no, about the fact that my nephew, he knows who his father is. I help take care okay, of that. Okay, what are you right here? What you know about your son? Ma'am, ma'am, the truth is the truth. When she see men, she pounce. She pounce. Three. She pounce. Three. In the case of Bye. two year old Kyle, John, you are the father. Bye. 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 John was the father. Here's the update Crystal says she and John are no longer a couple, but they're co parenting and they're getting along great. He stepped up, so that's great news. Now, who could forget Michelle and Dustin? You see, after surviving a horrific attack, Dustin never thought he could have kids. But a miracle occurred when Dustin's fiance, Michelle, gave birth to their son, Kaysen. Sadly, Dustin's cousin, Robbie, and his girlfriend, Emma, had serious doubts if Dustin was the father. Watch this. When I was 17 years old, I caught my ex-girlfriend cheating on me. You know what she did? She put a brick in her bag, and she hit me in the balls with it. Michelle. You're 100% sure that this is Dustin's miracle baby. I am 100% sure that he is the father of my child. You're
Your family doesn't think so. Well, I'm here today to prove them wrong, Molly. She got mad and she put a brick in a purse. She swung that, Molly. I walked half a block. I picked that up off the floor and I put it right back there and I walked. The doctors told you at the time that I had zero chance. You had zero two. chance to have zero. a job. Why are you so positive that he's not the father? There's been times when my, uh, where Michelle has cheated on my cousin. One set of eyes is darker and the noses are different. <laughs> In the case of four-month-old Kaysen, Dustin, you are the father. I told you. 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 So what happened to Michelle and Dustin after the show? Take a look at this video update. Hey, Maury, Dustin and I are doing great. We have been married for two years now, and they are happier than ever. Our son, Kaysen, is two years old now and is growing up so fast. I'm happy to say he's a daddy boy. Thanks, Maury. You are not the father. <laughs>